There are certain stories that come to us at Gleaning for the World that are just heart-wrenching. When you are working with the refugees from uh, the ISIS, from extreme Muslims, the, the Christians are the ones, uh, along with the moderate Muslims, that are just being persecuted. Uh, we hear stories of children being beheaded, of, of families being destroyed, of girls as young as nine and ten years old being sold into sexual slavery. But one story that really caught our attention, uh, we've been working with uh, a group in that region to get supplies to the Christians and the modern Muslims. And there was one family where the violence got so bad uh, and being on the execution list for ISIS, uh, they sold their house. They would be considered middle-class America. You, and it, the day after they sold their house, their daughter was kidnapped by uh, the Muslim extremist. And they told them that they would uh, give their daughter back if they would give them the money that they had gotten from selling their house. So they gave up everything they had, uh, all the money they had on the face of the earth, uh, to be able to get their daughter back. And they were thankful to be able to do it because their daughter would have ended up in sexual slavery and probably would only live two or three years in complete torture. Their daughter was brought back, but they were broke. And they have ended up in a refugee camp. Uh, Gleaning for the World was able to work with our partner agency and get supplies on the ground so that they would have food to eat, they would have the personal care items that they needed. Uh, they're still in a refugee camp, but we were able to find a Christian church that they could be uh, related to and be able to get some further help. It's, it's horrible what is happening to uh, the Jewish people, to the Christians, to the modern Muslims. The amount of just extreme torture that the people are going through uh, the refugee camps that have hundreds of thousands of people and very little food and support. We have to do everything we can. And I thank you for trusting Gleaning uh, with your donations to allow us to continue to work in that region of the world and give people at least a chance to be able to make it so that the Muslim extremists do not win, but instead God wins because of our heart.